Alright, so once again there were technical issues. Fraps decided to mess up on my second part recording. So I've lost all that. Then when I was exiting out of it, to make sure that everything recorded correctly, then my computer just froze, which required a restart, and I lost the audio that I recorded while I was playing the second part. So that is a lose-lose for me. So out the audio and out the gameplay. I would, in probably a normal game, replay it, but I know that my reaction would not be the same as I'd be playing through the same part of stuff that I've already done and I know exactly what I was doing. So, I'm just going to briefly catch you up on what happened. Basically, I went downstairs into the basement, had to hit three buttons to start the power, while running around avoiding one guy who was chasing me. Then after that, came back up to try to get out. Well, the good old priest dude knocks me out with a syringe. You wake up in the cell block, where these, like, naked people, yes, naked people, talk about how they're gonna kill you, how they wanna kill you, how they're gonna wait to kill you, though, but then who's gonna get what part of your body, la da 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 So they fucking chase you, so that's creepy. Well, they don't chase you, they just follow you, they act all nice. Uh, big fat fuck stills chasing you down there. Apparently he thinks he's trying to contain the situation. So he doesn't want the truth to get out, so that's probably why he's gunning you down. All the while, there was one creepy long hallway with a bunch of lightning flashes in which the naked dude appeared. It was fucking creepy as hell. Had to dive out a window and shimmy your way over and continue on your way. So I believe the part where I'll be starting from is going to be just after Tubby tries chasing you and you get away. So let's see what we can do. And hopefully this time everything's working, my computer won't freeze, it won't crash again. Yada yada yada. So, there's an explosion up yonder somewhere. Got thrown down here into a pile of dead bodies. And it's dark as hell. Oh, and also, in some cases where you hide, people can actually find you and, like, pull you the fuck out. God, he sounds like he's, like, right in the room. That'd be fucking creepy if he was. Yeah, as you can see, fucking fatty's still trying to get me. No, oh, now what? No, why am I looking that way? Got no idea if this is the right way to go. Probably not. This door. Jesus. He is following me. I can hide under here. Conserve my batteries. I think he walked past me. Pretty sure that was a dead end. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna like run right into him. <coughs> oh, 
wonder if Fatty can get over barricades. Oh shit, I almost thought I saw him for a second. Um, shut the fuck up, because this is when you're fucking talking. Seriously, I wish I knew where this guy was. It fucking sounds like he's right next to me. Um, what the fuck? How the, how the hell did he get ahead of me? Okay, so he for sure walked by the room. Everyone saw that, right? There's a fucking door there. Nobody's going that way. Fine, then I'll go this way. I think that's where I have to go. I can get over that stuff. Fanny can move. through the skinny place. I know fat people cannot go through skinny places, for a fact. Oh my god. Jesus. Holy fuck, that scared me. I don't think people in the insane asylums make that noise. Oh my god. I don't really want to go in there. Get a fresh battery ready to go. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know, I don't like you because you're walking towards me. You know what? I don't like you. Stop it. This thing needs to stop, like, staring at me. Fucking like it. Leave me alone. Leave me the fuck alone. Oh, wow. That is really happening. Wow. 
Wow. This is gonna turn out good. Don't you determine the dead will fall on the living? Did not kill his enemies. Please leave me alone. I just want the file. You can stay down there. <laughs> Alright, we got an obituary. Rudolf G. Wernicke. Dr. Rudolf G. Wernicke, age 90, passed away doing the work he loved on February 28th, 2009. He was born in 1918 in Munich, Germany, and achieved fame in the mathematic and scientific communities for a paper written with early computer pioneering Alan Turing. After the cloudy history with the German war effort, he immigrated to the United States in 1949 with a visa from the State's Department. Several decades of government research in Los Alamos led to New Mexico, where Dr. Wernicke retired to pursue landscape photography and care for his cats. He came to Colorado shortly after the turn of the millennium to pursue charitable work for the Murkoff Corporation. A statement from the company calls Dr. Wernicke a true humanitarian with a generous spirit. He leaves no survivors. In more ways than one. Dun dun dun. See a battery. Wallrider is all over this place. Murkoff is running an experiment here called Project Wallrider, where the patients talk about the Wallrider like it's a physical presence, a spirit or demon, something they found in the mountain. I chalk it up to schizophrenic delusions, but I just saw something. Maybe. Maybe it was a glitch in the camera. Or maybe this place is getting to me. Oh god, guys. Oh, I wasn't quite. 
quite ready to do that, but... Down the hole I go. fucking scared me. That's not creepy at all. Found scrawled in pencil in the back of an admittance form. Handwriting matches samples from patient father, Martin Archimabombed. Can't even fucking say his name. This god is real. What we've mistaken so long for ghost spirits, madness. We were only willing, fully ignorant. The scales on Saul's eyes were fear, and when you see beyond it, you truly see. This is the gift of the wall rider, the gospel of sand. The greatest sin in the world is willful ignorance of God, to receive a revelation and not spread it to the waiting flock. This place, to stand in the way of salvation, is a sin for which there is no punishment too great. Alright, so apparently the wall rider is the new person to spread the word of the Lord. Which I'm sure is totally a thing. That doesn't sound good. Oh, Jesus. God, he's still fucking following me. Ow, come on. Jesus. No, 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 no. Get the fuck away. Well, if you start going that way, then I'm most certainly not going that way. What 
use this shit. Oh my god, no. You do not just get to turn around like that. Oh, come on. I'm good. Pull them all. Creek like this last time. Exactly where I gotta go, I bet. Alright, well, I think as long as I can make it to that other small pipe thing, what are you gonna fucking come back again? terrifying sometimes on the fucking monsters. No, go somewhere else. You saw me over here. Don't go back that way. God, he just looks 110% angry. Jesus. Oh my god. Fucking fat 
Patty McFatterton. Right, I think I should hit a saving point. Maybe. See climbing up a fucking ladder. Alright, and there is the saving. So this is where I'll end part two of my videos. Technically, it would be part three of the game. And I do apologize once again for technology not being the best. <laughs>